Why do humans operate in comfort zones? There's a false idea that living a safe life is possible. And a safe life only brings us to a certain level. We have to operate at a higher level, which begins with breaking out of comfort zones. You gain confidence, you explore new things, you experience an abundant life living without limits. The energy we invest in life returns to us in what I call the boomerang effect. We all also have a story that we tell ourselves. We're the authors of our story. What is your story producing for you? And what is your story saying to others right now? Sometimes, you know what, it is important to be safe and to live cautiously. And sometimes when we're frustrated and things aren't turning out the way that we want, the way we've dreamed of, that's the universe pointing us to stretch. That frustration is a signal. It's time to stretch your boundaries. Take it slow. Make it a habit every day of doing something that makes you uncomfortable. It's the only way to have a future unlike the past. And it's available for all of us. What new behaviors daily will you commit to so that your name appears on a leaderboard? and that you celebrate some new deals that are amazing, way beyond anything you've previously imagined. Some people think they play it safe and they'll get through life unscathed. And I chuckle because that is not possible. No one escapes life unscathed. So why play it safe? And in order to maximize performance, we need some anxiety, what's called the optimal anxiety. It pushes us. Have you ever turned in a paper laid or done a takeoff at the last minute for a bid? Because it was optimal anxiety that pushed you and it got you to the next level. And that was because you waited to the last minute. Imagine if you start to use that optimal anxiety to produce new, bigger results because you took a risk. Risk and reward are related in life and it has a lot to do with making yourself uncomfortable. It's our own brain that tries to enroll us in comfort. And it's busy work that sometimes becomes the excuse for not doing something that's uncomfortable. It's best best to stay focused on the task at hand and you can balance it and have a life that you've dreamed of that includes family and work and yes sometimes there's sacrifices that need to be made but with smart goals and eliminated eliminating busy work we find time to create the life that we've dreamed of so commit to a daily activity that makes you uncomfortable and experiment for yourself and see what the new results are. See if in fact you don't win and have the life you've dreamed of and benefit many, many others because you can, because you'll have plenty to spare and share. So get uncomfortable and create the life you've dreamed about. Thank you.